Hello guys, it's Daisy Dino, and today I'm going to be showing you my thoughts and kind of a review on the Legacy Collection Spinosaurus. By the way, this is an entry for the Jurassic World Year One Toy by Matthew Bader, so. Anyways, with that out of the way, let's get a look at this Spinosaurus. So, in a little better um, render, we can see the Spinosaurus in all its glory. Um, I do think this is an amazing figure, amazing. There are some little nitpicks that I have with it, but otherwise, it's amazing. So, let's start out with the good things. <laughs> Well, it probably is the best Spinosaurus we've gotten in, let's see, like 18 years, ever since the uh, animatronic Spinosaurus. So it's really nice. I mean, it's such an amazing figure. Um, as you can see, you have two points of articulation in the neck, which is amazing. You also got some really nice range of motion in the arms, the legs, And of course, the tail. The next thing I love about this figure is the action feature. It's so fun to play with and that's really a great thing. You also have an absolutely wonderful paint job. For an example, going down the head, the eyes painted really nicely. There's the white stripe that goes down. The spine is absolutely wonderful, and so is the tail. And then my favorite thing about this dinosaur is indeed the sculpt. Just looking at the head, the teeth, the um, little crests up here, um, it's just amazing. Going down the whole body, you've got some nice ridges and scales everywhere. It's just a really, really nice sculpted figure, so it's amazing. Now here's the problem with my Spinosaurus. So yeah, the first thing is that my Spino's tail is really loose. But fortunately, I have a solution. I just twist the tail this way, and it can pop into place. But the other bad part about it is that it's not centered. So another thing is, uh, yeah. Why is it so short? I mean, between the shortness of the tail and the spine, it's kind of disappointing that both of those things are really short and out of proportion with the body. But other than that, I really love this figure. And if you ever get a chance to get it, then it's great. So yeah, that pretty much sums it all up about my thoughts about the Spinosaurus. Also, again, this is an entry for Matthew Brando's Jurassic World Year 1 toy, so hopefully that happens. But anyways, I hope to see you guys again, and thank you for looking at my video, and I will see you guys later. Bye! Goodbye, my friends.